Your self-image sucks and it's holding you back more than you can imagine. The reason for your procrastination, eating all those foods that you know are bad for you, watching adult content and busting more gallons of milk in a dairy farm. It's because of your poor self-image. You see yourself as not up to standard. You look at other people and are overcome with jealousy. It literally pains you to see where you are, but you have no belief that this will ever change. But there's one secret to success, one secret to everything that will change your life. One thing that can boost your life times a million. Are you able to improve your self-image? Every day you watch as everyone else excels in life. Why does he have money? Why is he jacked? Why does he get all the girls? Maybe because he doesn't stink? Everyone else has everything while you, you have nothing. You feel useless and you feel like this will never change as if you've been cursed. And you put labels on yourself, all these bad things. You think you're a loser, can't achieve anything. And you haven't got the skills to accomplish your dreams. Not able to achieve things. Don't have the skills to do anything. You have a negative view of the world. You hate women, you hate men. Money is evil. But this mindset is holding you back. This negative belief will mean you'll never be rich, never get healthy, never be happy, never get pussy, you'll never get freedom. And it's a shame, but it hasn't got to be. Because I'm going to tell you how you can improve your self-image. Your self-image correlates directly to how successful you'll be. People that invented things did so because they knew they could do it. The biggest stars today are successful because they believed in themselves. They built quietly in the shadows because they believed that they could do that thing. All because they had a good self-image, all because they fully believed in themselves, with no doubt. If Steve Jobs doubted himself, we wouldn't have Apple, we'd have Pear or some bullshit. If Usain Bolt doubted himself, he wouldn't have broken several world records. Put the small island of Jamaica on the map, he wouldn't have done any of that. But if you don't do that and you begin to doubt yourself, those dreams you have will not come to fruition. You'll be stuck doing the same thing you are right now, or maybe even worse. And no one wants to do that. I told myself that I can't do it. I'm not smart enough. I don't know anything. I saw all these guys online making money. I thought they were scammers. They can't do it. I can't do it. Those guys must be lying. Some of them were. But some weren't. And I felt some of that money in my account. I didn't want to make YouTube videos because I thought that I couldn't do YouTube. I can't edit videos. I don't know anything. I didn't go to the gym because I thought that I wasn't athletic. I wasn't genetically gifted like all these other guys in the gym. All those guys are on gear. Can't you see? Your self-image is exactly what's holding you back and stopping you from doing the things that you could be successful in. Because I know for a fact there's something that you want to do that's on your mind that you just don't want to do because you don't believe in yourself. But if you stop the doubt, you'd have such an amazing life. All you have to do is to improve and gain success is improve your self-image. Because once your self-image changes, your actions change along with them. So how do you work on your self-image? How do you change how you view yourself? How can you start doing all the things to live an amazing life? Get girls, find love, be more social, make money. There's one simple method that everyone's been using to become successful. The one method that everyone on their way to success is trying to implement into their life. All you have to do is fake it. In the same way your ex-girlfriend used to fake her orgasms, you must be able to fake who you are. I know it sounds weird, your whole life you've been told to be yourself. Don't try to be someone you're not. But let's be honest, you've been yourself and how's that worked out for you? You haven't been successful doing so. You've not been working on your goals. You've been working towards your goal. Camel on Call of Duty. No one will tell you these things, but at the moment, you suck. And being yourself continuously just does not work. When you fake it, your self-image improves. And I know it's cringe, but instead of being a loser, you're now a chad. You're muscular, you're handsome, you're confident, even if you're not. Your self-image of being a strong, courageous man drives you to be a strong, courageous man. You're now on your purpose. You can now talk to girls. You now eat the right foods. And you're doing the right things to maintain the positive self-image you created in your mind. And over time, you build your self-image up because you were able to master your mind. Your mind becomes stronger and you believe more and more who you truly are. And you do the positive actions more and more, continuously faking it until you don't have to anymore. Until you are confident, until you are courageous, until you are on your purpose fully. By faking it till you make it, you're no longer a geek, and now you're a super saiyan. Now you can achieve everything. Now you can be yourself. Now you don't have to fake it. Now who you are is worth something. You can be yourself fully. And yeah, your old self might see it through sometimes. You may feel like you can't do it and you don't deserve anything. But don't give up. Because you will take L's. But don't take them L's in vain.